look at this thing on the day of roller. Oh, sorry. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back today, guys, to the channel Forza Horizon 5. We're back today with the 2020 Ford F450 Super Duty. Uh, I've wanted to drive this for quite some time. Uh, I think the only so. time that I have driven this was with the pre-release that I had access to. And right, I did a nice little build on there. We had some fun with it, but that was before the knowledge of snow tires, I do believe. So we have yet to really get a good little drift build on this truck. So I'm excited Turn to do around. so for today. We're going to go ahead and do some upgrades. I'm excited for this one, man. Hopefully get this thing up to a 7-speed gearbox. I don't have paddles, and uh, we max out at 7th gear. I know this thing's got quite a few of them, but okay, we got a full tank of gas for this one, right? This is going to be a lot of fun. Huge thanks for Turn watching around. for today. And of course, before we start today, dad joke of the day. This one coming from Greg Molasson last episode. He goes, dad joke, why do golfers bring two pairs of pants to the golf course just in case they get a hole in one, right? Obviously, yards. we've heard that one before. Dad Huge thank you for leaving it down below. Leave your dad jokes down there. And of course, don't forget to slap that like button. 6.2 V8, V10, 7.7 V12, holy, 6.5 V12, 5.8 V8, uh, racing 7.2 liter V8, that actually, oh, then we got the 7.4 liter V8 twin turbo. We're gonna make this thing real wheel drive. It's just seeing, it's gonna slide. It's gonna slide real nice, I feel like. Can we do anything on the front? Probably not. Just lights and yeah, definitely not doing the rally bed. Okay, so this is gonna be the secret sauce here, the snow tires. Uh, we're gonna see what this thing finishes up for the classes. Maybe we can hop into a regular drift lobby or 450s. 460s or 450s. We might as well go with the 460s. Why not? Hit reduction brings us down to 5,700 pounds, quite a bit. Now we cannot do anything engine wise, which kind of sucks. Okay. Oh, look at this one. It's like the stock paint. I like that. All right, here we go. Hopefully Forza does add a couple more trucks in the process these next few months coming up. Hopefully the Tundra gets added in. I don't know why they wouldn't. I think that'd be a great opportunity. Oh, this don't, yeah, this is definitely interesting. Those turbos, when they kick in, they kick. Ooh. That 450 coming down the mountain. Yeah, this thing is nice. 17 horsepower, I mean, we don't need too much more. I don't know if this was the best engine for this, but as you guys can see, I mean, it is, right? Damn. It's holding. Brakes, 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 sorry, sorry. Barely did any tuning to this whatsoever. It was basically drift diff. Ooh, ooh. There we go, there we go. Yeah, these snow tires, I love them, man. I absolutely love them. A little top speed run with this here. Oh, too much, too much. Nope, nope. So right now, what are the chances of us actually getting in to an open drifting A-class rear wheel drive? Probably quite slim. Gonna be honest with you, but there's always a possibility. You never know. Oh, yeah, we just off road there. A class, come on, A class, A class. Please don't wreck my handbrake either. Come on, A class, A class. Oh, it's A class. Is it robo drive? I don't think it matters, does it? We bring in anything? A class what? A class what? It doesn't say. Right now, while we're waiting here for everyone to join up, looks like I don't know why it's taking so long. Uh, the full rig overview right now. We got the Thrustmaster TSXW base. We got the 383 wheel add-on here. We got the Sparco handbrake TH8A shifter down here. TLCM pedals down below. And looks like we're going to be able to use our truck here for today. All Thrustmaster's links will be found down below for you guys. We do have the hub working on the Xbox. So we can use both of these at the same time here um, on the Xbox Series X. Here we go, man. I wonder if anyone else has brought in the truck. No way. No one else has brought in the truck, guaranteed. There's only four people. Okay, never mind. My handbrake working. Please tell me it's working. Oh, it is. Okay, okay. okay here we go. We got one good lap in here. Hopefully. Let's see if we can do it. That lap was junk, so I'm not going to worry about it. This one, no, this one may be the lap, though. Got a good feeling about this truck. 
We got, what, four damn 30s on the back, whatever they were. Absolute monstrous tires for this thing. But I felt like the great white just felt appropriate. It's big. It's bulky, but it's quick, though. Come on. Yeah. Pop that clutch. Just kind of stick with him here, run his line. I don't think we're going to get anywhere close to where he is with the 500, but... Would be nice. Oh, I did not want to have to use the handbrake. That's exactly why. A fourth gear will go with momentum, but it just... It won't go by itself, seems like. Holy shit! I would have really enjoyed that with some points there on that. Look at this. Yeah, fourth gear again. Struggling. But once we get it, though, it's just because they're so sticky, man. They're so grippy. I probably should have had um, a little bit more rear tire pressure, in all honesty, but that's okay. Get me out of last place. Hey, there we go. Bang. Hopefully he doesn't pass me there. This truck was definitely not easy with this truck. I'll tell you that right now. I'm going to try this on the control here. Let's see if it's any better. Look at this thing on the day of roller. Oh, sorry. Oh, my. And a quick sip of my coffee while they're pulling me out off the shoulder there. Sorry. 338. That's embarrassing, right? What the heck? Oh, there's the truck on the podium. Surprised it even fits. I'd like to know down below what truck you want to see next. I mean, there's, there's a lot of them that could be added in. The Dodge Ram would be cool. Toyota Tundra would be cool. Um, I don't know. Let me know. All right. How many we got? Hopefully a couple more joined us. I think we should. Ha oh my God! Yeah, we do. We got a. We got a couple more. Nobody with the Ford F450 though. We're the only F450 in here. Yeah, if you guys have missed any of the last few episodes on the channel, we've been going back on a set of course up playing with the crew. Uh, we're on Chitoko. We're doing some drift lobbies. Definitely been enjoying that once again. If you guys um, are enjoying it, let me know or let me know what you'd like to see. We're in our camera for some reason. Ford gear. Yeah, we do. Oh. Oh, here, thank you. That only kept sliding out because of the fact that we were a little bit sideways there. You know, third gear. Third gear seems way better. Look at everybody. Oh, I love this. Yeah, we need more open drifting style games on this game, man. I feel like. Oh. Big truck coming in. Oh! Not the best. We do have another. Look at how small it looks. That's the Silverado. Holy, I can't believe that. What a damn Diverti. Whatever the hell that thing is. Huge entry. Straight to fourth gear. Just got to slam it into gear. There's no time to waste in between changes. This thing will just rip right the heck on it. Right. There we go. Go, go. Oh, we're running it. Let's get it. We got a nice little section here, looks like. Whatever the hell this is. Oh, <laughs> just slammed that. I wish simulation damage was on. Go. That's 71. We got 242 on that lap. Not the best, not the worst, I guess. There we go. So a tan. I'm seeing the 240. Jeez, man. I love this truck, though. Just fun to drift around. Just bigger rigs out here. Oh. That's exactly why we need snow tires, though. You get a car like this, or a truck, sorry, that just won't drift, say. Throw some snows on it, and uh, you got yourself quite the ride. Here we go. Pass on the outside, no. Probably not going to do any better than the 242. Yeah, we're not going to do any better. BMO knows it. He's getting the win. Oh, yeah, he's hitting the 360. I like your style, sir. Oh, yeah, look at the truck. Damn, it looks good. Oh, I love those gold wheels. How come we don't get more of those? Okay, we're in third place still. Third place. All right, hopefully everyone has a great weekend. 
Uh, we got a couple new things coming out for Forza Horizon 5 this week. If you guys have not already seen the rollover, um, I don't know. I mean, the grind, I just haven't wanted to do the grind. It's like hour, two hours to get the cars. Not a huge fan of the way that they've been doing the seasonal cars on there. I wish, you know, something would be changed up a little bit um, in terms of that repetitive uh, grind out, I guess. I'd love to know your thoughts down below on how you acquire the seasonal cars. Um, it's a grind I right? I don't know. I just haven't wanted to do it. Has it been something that I've uh, wanted to hop online and just grind out two hours getting a vehicle that I'm only going to drive for a little bit? Right? Ooh! Just miss the days of the car packs, man. Just give us a big old car pack once a month again. That would be great. Oh! Yes. This is a nice little section. Can't see it in. Oh, I didn't know which way they're going. Oh! I don't think a lot of people did. Back in the main point to the left, yep. Ooh. Took out all those signs, so sorry. Go back down the third. Easy throttle control. A couple people are at 145 kill already in. Come on, truck. We are currently leading the pack, so hopefully our smoke can get in everyone's face. Man, that was just gorgeous. That was cool. Over here. Ooh! Man! No! Got a B-ball in front of us once again. I can't believe this man's holding first every single run, man. Congrats. Respect. I'm going to test this car a little bit later on, make sure everything's copacetic underneath that thing. I feel like he's cheating though, right? It's too good out here. He's definitely not A-class. And it's got to be S1, right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. However, though, hold a 182 on that lap. That's actually not that bad. I am curious, though. Are we getting into these lobbies because of the fact that we were driving in A-class? Or is the fact that we just got really lucky on that? You guys find that it's been you know, kind of matching you with the car that you're bringing into these servers? Or did we just get really fortunate? Okay, you guys let me know in the comments. Appreciate that. Oh, whoa, that actually shifted me there. Yeah, we definitely take off that extra rear tire tread that I did. I pump up the tires and probably make this a little bit of a jelly tune. I think, uh, oh my. First build with the F450 Dewey. I do like this. I really like this a lot. Uh, we just need a little bit of fine tuning on this and it will be perfect. Absolutely perfect. Let's the front of that. That's pretty cool. Hard swing. Third gear. Let the trucks wait through the work. Come on now. No. Those twin turbos just kick it right out. Still don't know exactly where this engine came out of, but I know it's quick. I know that. Oh, oh. Here we go. Don't hit that again. Here we go. Seven seconds. Get me out of these tunnels before they close. Yep. That's intimidating. Seeing that thing. Look at how big it is. Finished eighth. Do we hold podium is the question. I don't think we do. Okay. Well, that was definitely uh, missed by a couple points here. We're 25 points. Podium finish at 32. BMO 4300 with a solid 60 point finish. He won every event. Man's killing it. Heck yeah, let's go, man. Huge thanks for watching for today. For Dooley F450. A nice little uh, competitive lobby. Let me know if you guys have a tune for this thing. Would like to come back at this a little online session and uh, have some fun with you guys online there for a little lobby day. Huge thanks for watching. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. We got a wheel spin. Come on, man. Please. 8-6? Eight, 8-6? Six? Eight, six? Go! See you guys back here tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.